Oh. Holy shit! Oh. 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 <laughs> 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 Is that time for a piss break? Get out of the bushes, dude. All right, guys and gals. Heading to my local trail center to do some riding. It's about 25 degrees out. So I haven't been riding that much outside. It's, you know, there's been snow on the ground and it's just been wicked cold. So behind me, I don't know if you can see the bike through the back window. I got a new bike. It's a new bike day. I'm looking around my car. I didn't bring my clipless shoes. I'm so mad. So I just got my Nikes on right now. I got like boot covers that keep your feet warm and dry. So I think I'm just gonna have to put the booties on my sneakers. Good thing I have flats. I always keep flats in the car, flat pedals. So I'll just bolt those on and we'll see how it goes. So I just got the flat pedals on. I got my Nikes on and I threw uh, some boot covers on it, some rain protected ones. Keeps your feet warm too, so. We'll see how this goes. I find my feet are probably just gonna get kicked off the bike because I don't even have suspension, so. Because it's the fat bike. All right, guys, welcome JC Trails. Bringing you a bike review with The Punisher. This time we're reviewing the 2017 Specialized Fat Boy Carbon Comp. So we're gonna climb up here. We're back in Pine Hills. We're gonna do some single track in the snow, obviously. Got a, about two or three inches. Do some downhills. Hopefully we stay on course and don't slide off in the woods. So as we're making a climb here, it's a pretty light bike, but you definitely feel the resistance of the fat tires in the snow. It's a lot of drag, but a lot of grit. This is great training for spring riding. Get back on your skinny tires, on your trail bike, and you're gonna fly. Punisher's an animal. It's a pedal machine. It's actually a beautiful day out though. But this definitely wouldn't be uh, possible on a trail bike today. The snow's just a little too deep. It's close. There's some spots where it's, it's bare, and then there's some spots on the trail that are two inch, three inches of snow, so you definitely just slide out without the big fat tires. We'll talk about the Fat Boy real quick and what's on it, what I've changed to make it my personal bike. Still got more modifications to come, but uh, it's a full carbon frame. It is the Fat 10M carbon, the entire frame and fork are all carbon. I added personally uh, these carbon bars, come with aluminum ones, 750 millimeters wide. Also changed the tires, comes with the ground control 4.0 tires. I added the Maxxis Minion FBF 26 by 4.0. Rolls fast and nice for a fat tire. And pretty much the same thing in the rear, but just the FBR. Has aluminum wheels with the Stout XC Pro hubs. It's a 10 speed with an extended range cassette. I believe it's a 11 to 40 tooth and a SRAM XO rear derailleur and a SRAM X9 shifter. With the race face turbine cranks, pretty good. Shimano Dory brakes and aluminum seat posts and the specialized Phenom saddle. I really like this saddle with the little space here. The Grundle just, it really likes that. Let's do this to it. Fat boy, what you gonna do? Starts off real pedally. Oh yeah, a little downhill. Traction is good. Whew. Damn, this derailleur is nice. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Oh, this is so fun. It's nice having a carbon frame and bars though. I said that before. Makes the bike a little, ugh, I got that bitch, a little lighter. And you're hitting these roots and little rocks. The tire does absorb a little of the, the shock, but if the carbon takes out that constant vibration when you're at speed. So your hands don't get as tired. Whew. I see. So size medium bike, I'm 5'10", 175 pounds. And I could probably go with a large too, but I like a little smaller bike so it's a little more flickable. Especially a fat bike. A little downhill. You. <laughs> oh, there's so much power in the pedal though. There's no bob. Oh God, there's zero bob. You push those pedals down, it's shooting you forward. All that traction of these Maxxis, God damn, 4.0 tires. Clean this one up. <sighs> Hello. Thanks. A little trail maintenance. Frozen in the ground. This is really fun. Yeah, it's not bad. It's a kick in the ass too. The are deep when you break oh, I know. Oh, Kicking the nut workout right now. Got to keep in shape. So go out west. Keep up with all those dudes. Oh God, that was Peter coming off. The turnover on the fat bike is pretty good. Ooh, dirt. Oh. Oh, it's pure ice. Jeez. It's a good day to get out on the bike today. Sun's out. Might be cold as balls, but oh. hey, I'm pedaling. Punisher's pedaling. Get some exercise in, and it's still freaking fun as hell. Whew. Little climb. Look at how these bikes hook up so well. Just climb anything. There you go. Oh, holy shit! Oh, oh. <laughs> Woo! <sighs> Is that time for a piss break? Get out of the bushes, dude. <sighs> yeah, you did move the tree. This place is fine. Look at this. Go around here. Then you have a little berm turn. A little downhill right here. We got some dirt. Oh God. <laughs> Holy shit. Off camber. <sighs> kind of glad I don't have my flats on there. Get my foot out quick. <sighs> Holy shit. Oh. Great view. A little boulder, watch out for that. Holy shit! Nice, dude. 
<laughs> it's a smooth line. Oh god. It is hard without clips. My feet are just getting kicked off. No clips, no suspension. Old school, baby. That's how we used to do it. Fucking monster truck over that. <laughs> yes! We made it out. Dude, that was <laughs> sick. That was good. I'm gonna climb up, or back up, do some uh, double track, double wide downhill. Come on, baby. This is way better than an indoor trainer. Climbing on a fat boy's kicking my ass. Come on. Got a little tech coming up. Oh, how close. Gotta get that line. Oh. Yes! Yeah, boy. I need a break. These trails, keep going. Uh, these are impossible on a trail bike, right? There's no way you can do this on your Epic or your Camber. Like this stuff? In the snow? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. No, I don't think Yeah. Yeah, you probably make a couple sections, but. Yeah, this would definitely be. Keep a slide, yeah. So you know like fat vikings like it's like an adventure more than a ride you know what i mean oh, yeah. like we're going somewhere like a camping or some shit yeah, that, like, a backpack. yeah i like that though it makes the same trails feel different you know yeah, you go straight? yeah straight to the bottom balls out dude you, you want, you want to go i don't know i gotta get this on camera crack. hopefully <laughs> okay crashes gets views it's interesting with no suspension Guys! Oh god, my feet are just coming out the pedals. <laughs> Can't see where the rocks are. Oh, oh. oh my god. Oh! Man down! Oh! The seat just went up my ass. Oh. oh, that hurt. Ah. I almost died on one section. Good ride, Punisher. Awesome ride. <laughs> yeah, dude. Just finished up the ride with uh, Punisher, and uh, we had a nice fat bike adventure. Um, that's what these bikes are good for. You got in the same trails. They're completely different when there's snow on the ground. A lot of work. It's great training for uh, the springtime when you're back on your trail bike. There's so much more resistance on the tires. But guys, thanks for joining me today. Uh, if you want to see more bike reviews, please subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. See you next time. Peace. <laughs>